uh, the government's money, spending the government's money and raising your taxes over time. And now we have a trillion dollar deficit. It's not sustainable and it's unacceptable. Well, now there's also another Tea Party hook in what looks to be one of the best state Senate races here in the Hudson Valley this year. And that is for Vinnie Libel's seat. Of course, he's an incumbent Republican who hasn't announced he's leaving the seat just yet, uh, representing Northern Westchester Putnam part of Dutchess. Uh, but he's apparently going to run for Putnam County Executive. That creates an opening. Greg Ball, Republican uh, Assemblyman, wants it. And Mike Kaplowitz, Democratic County. Westchester County Maybe legislator, this week went to Greg Ball's office and said, you are sending out messages on the taxpayer's dime promoting a Tea Party rally this week, and that's unfair and illegal. What did you make of that? Well, first of all, it's a silly, uh, it's a silly argument because if Greg Ball was telling people about a rally, uh, that's public information anyway. So all he was doing was conveying to them that if they had grievances against the government, they can go to a rally. What's more important is that Mike Kaplowitz, for the last, I don't know, four or five terms as a Democratic member of the Board of Legislature, was working with Andy Spano to, to make your taxes the highest in the United States. And I don't think that's a real strong platform for Mike to run on against Greg Ball. Well, first of all, Mike Kaplowitz is not considered a um, left-wing radical the way that Greg Ball would like to pr pr present him as. He's been always been a moderate, and he's always been someone who has argued in favor of saving money. When it comes to the issue of the dysfunction of Albany, Greg Ball has been right up there in the state assembly participating well, and being a that's part not of fair, the problem. Greg, the, when Greg was first elected, the first speech he made on the floor of the assembly, mm. if you will recall, oh, he absolutely. stood up and accused all yes. of his other college and, and, and women of being dysfunctional. What has he done to change, it? He done to well, change it other than to what, chase after but, the um, what, immigrants La in, Lawrence, in, in Putnam Lawrence, County? he was a Republican sitting in a Democratic chamber, uh, which was uh, chaired by Ch uh, Shelley, uh, Shelley Silver. Shelley. Now, if he is given a chance to go into the Republican Senate along with those two uh, people who will beat Susie Oppenheimer and Andrea Stewart Cousins, you'll have a Republican well, Senate. Finally, Michael, I want to hear what Greg we'll Ball's your explanation taxes. is for sending out this mail, or which taxpayers what? paid for, so and, and this, this silly argument that you're making about the fact that he's letting them know about a political rally. It's not a part, but it's not a partisan. It's, it's not a political. political. It's, part, it, no, it's, it's a non-partisan rally. Because we know rally. that the right. Tea Party um, revelers support Republicans tenderly. You're worried Lawrence, about so that, aren't you, Lawrence? Well, it's, it's, it's political. It's but, political. Libel's district is heavily Republican. Greg mm -hmm. Ball is popular. We've seen that in previous sure. elections. He most likely will win this election no matter who the Democrats put up. Mm -hmm. I, do you not agree with that? It's going to be a challenge. The thing about it, it's not an issue of incumbency. I would say if Mike Kaplowitz was the incumbent Democrat in this seat, I'd say he has a problem. I think he's got a fair shot because Mike he's not Kaplowitz an incumbent. Mike Kaplowitz cannot win that seat, whether it's Greg Ball or anybody else. Mm -hmm. Why, why wow. doesn't Vinny Libel just stay there? Why does he, he Because he wants to be county executive. I think, you know, Vinny's at the point where he doesn't want to drive up and down the throughway twice a week. That's, you know, Vinny's Albany. my age. Going That's, to it's tough stuff. Mm -hmm. It's tough stuff going to Albany I all year round. I think Kaplowitz can do it. He's a hard worker and he's very well respected. All right, gentlemen, we only have a couple minutes left. I want to ask you about the big picture.